Well, she looks like she feels better, too. Good. You're worried about her, aren't you, Velvet? No. It's nothing like that. Let me tell you something, kiddo. When young maidens ripen, they have trouble expressing their feelings. So Velvet's... ripen? Mogilu! Quit giving Loppy set confusing thoughts! <laughs> no trouble expressing those feelings, I see. is supposed to exist to bring peace and order to the world. Everything the Abbey does, everything Lord Melchior and Shepherd Artorius do, it ought to be rooted in that mission. And yet, something just doesn't feel right here. You are dismissed. That knowledge is not for you. Uh, uh... Something wrong? Whoa! Easy there. Just asking. S sorry I was just deep in thought. Is there something you need from me? Nah. Just heard a bunch of sighs and wondered if you were feeling sick or anything. No, I drank my Solitoma juice. Ah. Tasted like crap, didn't it? It... it wasn't that bad. Hey. What? Are you afraid of demons? No, I, I am not. It's more like I despise them. Ten years ago, a group of them attacked my village. They destroyed everything and everyone. Including your family? Yes. The only family I had at that point was my mother. And in all the chaos, she... All I have left of her is this hand mirror she gave me. I didn't want anyone else to have to feel the way I did. And so I became an exorcist in order to destroy demons. So you can keep your pity. Gotcha. I will then. called a pangyon, a type of bird native to this area. Pangyon. Their meat is succulent and tender, and makes a lovely stew. Wow, what's it taste like? You'd eat that poor thing? Savage. You're one to talk, demon. It was one of my mother's specialties. All right, enough of the chit-chat. Magilu. Hmm. Well, how do I... <sighs> oh. You know, like that. Like what? <sighs> well, Grimm's got a sort of listless... Well... Exactly! <sighs> What's up, kid? Magilu, you're a grown woman yourself. So... Good question. Put simply, a long time... Your feelings broke? Come on. Let's question the townsfolk.
So how do you like our island? It's quite a bit different from- This place was even more relaxed before the- But recently, a lot of our young folk- It's still better than it was when the demons first started showing up. We have the Abbey to thank for that. And because people are traveling more now, the need for ships has skyrocketed. In other words, when the money started flowing, people let it go to their heads? That and those exorcists and soldiers from the bigger cities, they really seemed sophisticated. People from the other eye getting worked up and worked over by what's trendy. Is that foolishness? If this keeps up... I understand how you... Still no leads on that grimoire lady. Mogulu, when did you get that letter from her you mentioned? Hmm, hard to say. It must have been last year? 
A decade ago? Take this seriously, or I'll feed you to the sharks. Oh, what? I think I'd at least rate a Kraken. Keep this up, and I swear I'll eat... It's them! The final preparations are complete. Once you've assumed your new post, everyone will act on your command. Thank you, sister. But to be honest, I worry that these shoes I'm filling might just be a bit too big for me. You need not worry. You possess a special strength and quality that others lack. Shepherd Artorius has high hopes for your deployment to Polymedes. Fear not. Just be yourself. Yes. I'll try. They're sending him to Polymedes? Is that the name of a facility on this island? I had better get... Safe travel. Oh, one more thing. Be careful around the demon and Haria. It's stronger than it looks. Understood. Also, if you... Sister... <laughs> I know... So... If so, it may prove... Still, what magical timing for Oscar to show up here at the very same hour we do. I understand your suspicion of me, but have you any proof? None, it's true. But. And soon you may wish we were. Eleanor hasn't been snitching on us, I'm sure of it. And how would you know? Are you watching her even when she's taking. Huh? <laughs> no, I don't! Then isn't it possible she. You pledged to obey me until the day. Yes, that I did. Remember, when you two trade blows, only the Abbey wins. One less demon, and one less traitor for them to worry about. While we're standing around here arguing, that demon could be attacking Grimoire! <sighs> it's true. Let's get some more people to quit. Oh. 
you have, young man. That's... Empyrean Ominoge? Yep, no doubt about it. I've seen her with my own eyes. You saw her? Well, the Abbey's banned any profession of the Ominochean faith in Southgand, despite her popularity. Gotta assume that's what got her all bent out of shit. I tried talking to her, but... Wait, that sounds like... And that low-energy goddess you saw? Yeah, more or less. Smiles upon thee, weary of Grimoire isn't human? When did I ever say she was? So, shopkeep, where'd you see her? I think it was down by McClear Beach. Pensively watching the tide come in? Ugh. Why didn't you mention Grimoire as a Moloch before now? Now. You can't be too careful with that information. Spies, spies listening everywhere! <laughs>
beautiful waters. So this is Muckler Beach. I hope she's actually here. 